Well, episode uh, 14. 14. I think last week I went first, so why don't you tell us what you're drinking this week, sir? I am drinking a horchata cream ale. Oh. And that is by... Is horchata like like cinnamon? It is, it's like cinnamon and rice. Like a rice... Okay. Something, like a, something. Like a, like a rice... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. It's by Epic Brewing. So is that going to be more of a dessert beer? Hochata cream? Like that sounds like it'd be more. It almost like sounds like holiday-ish, like festive. I'll let you know. It's good. It's good. It's got like, it's like light and crisp with like a, a cinnamon aftertaste. Okay. And cinnamon like lingers. Fucking, Fucking linger, lingers. man. <laughs> I would say if we wanted to get a little more specific, as you mentioned a couple episodes ago. Yeah. I'll give it like a, a 7.83. Oh, you went you went to the 10th. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. How about yeah, you? We didn't what do that. I think last week we stuck to... Uh, yeah, yeah typical, I think we did. Typical has. Um, so I have a, it's called Breezy Does It, as opposed to like like Easy Does It, Breezy Does It, uh, by the Left Hand Brewing Company. Um, it is a passion fruit sour ale, and they are based out of a place. I think, didn't I have a left hand a couple weeks ago? I think you did. I think I did. Oh, here we go. They're from Longmont, Colorado. That's not where mine was from. Hmm. Well, let's see. Breezy does it. Let's I don't remember see. those words ever coming out of my mouth. It's not bad. It definitely has the the fr- the fruity. Like it, it. It's just like a bag of like take say you had like a bag of like Skittles and you put all of them in your mouth at once, like every flavor. So you know, it's like a natural like that. Not you can't pinpoint the fruit flavor to it. If I um, if I had to equate me doing that to a beer, I'd give it a nine. But it's not that sour. I just mean throwing a throwing a handful of Skittles in my mouth. I meant more of like the flavor profile is like just like that general fruit flavor. Like you can't. Okay. It says it's passion fruit, but it's it's fruity. You know, that's all I got for it. It's like eating some like some. Fruit chews, you know. Okay. It's just it's fruity. Um if we're getting to technical like you were doing down to the what tenth, I'd probably give it like a seven five five. It's okay. Okay. If it was a little more sour, if it had that bite to it, um, it'd be in the eights, but it's it's it kind of just hits like a fruit fruit ale. Like if you told me this was a sour after I drank it, I'd say you're a liar. Okay, so it does, it just, it's not. It's it doesn't literally have that, not that sour. It doesn't have that 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 crisp that bite. Yeah, it doesn't doesn't make my my cheeks. You know what I mean? Like you just ate warhead. Mm-hmm. Which I really want out of a sour. So, hey, uh, left hand, it's decent, but you need more uh, more clench. Not of the butthole. Well, to each their own. Well, if you want the butthole, whatever. 